Microsoft launched a brand new app called Loop, which is a competitor for Notion. In this video, we'll see some of the major differences between Microsoft Loop and Notion. Right off the bat, if you are familiar with the Notion interface, Loop gives you the same vibe. But Notion has an upper hand when it comes to embedding information from other websites like YouTube, Google Maps, and many more, which they have already established over the years. Since Microsoft Loop is new, it only is capable of working across the Microsoft 365 Office applications, which can come really handy, especially in offices for collaboration. Secondly, both of these platforms have AI-powered backup, which helps you to summarize or make things easier. However, Microsoft Loop is limited in comparison to Notion, while Notion can do many more tasks and help you get along a lot. I use Notion personally for my workflow, especially for my content creation, and it has made things a lot easier when it comes to organizing my entire workflow. But the catch is that Notion, though it is a free app, if you want to use it for your teams or get it for an enterprise, then you have to pay a price. While the Loop application currently is free and is included along with your Office 365 applications. However, I feel like Loop has a lot of potential, especially with offices and collaborative applications and with Copilot, it will definitely give it a upper hand in the long term. It's just new and has a lot of potential. Anyways, I'd like to know your thoughts in the comments below. That's it from me. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and see you in the next one.